Hey, what's going on guys? Today I wanted to do a video review for the Kausar TV stand. In this video review, I'm just gonna walk you through some of the assembly. We're actually gonna take a look at some of the functions on the electric fireplace, and I'm just gonna go through everything. So first off, in terms of assembly, this actually comes with two boxes, so the fireplace itself will actually come separate and gets mounted into the center here. In terms of assembly, I was able to build the entire thing by myself um, pretty much within an hour. Um, I do recommend assembling it in the place where you're gonna be putting it because it is quite heavy once fully assembled. Um, you have this really nice walnut top that goes all across the top here. We have a very small sound bar here, but as you can see, there's more than enough space. You could fit a very, very large sound bar up here or anything else you want, speakers. Um, you have really nice design going all throughout. You can see the wood um, kind of going throughout here. All the pieces came in really nice condition. It has some really nice accents going all throughout the bottom, through the front and the doors. Each of the doors opens up and you have uh, mounting options here where you could go either very low in the middle or even higher if you choose to. These could be used for consoles or just general storage. You also have these two large bays. Um, you can see here as an example, we have an Xbox One just sitting in one of these bays. So you might even be able to fit up to two consoles um, simultaneously next to each other, or you could fit them in separate bays. There's a wire area there in the back that's actually can be used on either side. So you can run your wires right back to your TV. And um, both of these doors also have uh, simple latches. So there's just mag magnets here. So when you shut them, they stay shut. Um, in terms of assembly, like I said, pretty straightforward, very, very high quality build, just really feels like a very high quality TV stand from others I've used in the past. Now, in terms of the actual fireplace, when you get this, there's a couple simple assembly steps. There's these stones that you lay out through the bottom that essentially just rest on top of these LED strips. There's little orange stones to kind of accent um, along most of the clear stones. And then you have these little wood pieces you can just kind of place however you choose. Um, once you turn this on, you have several functions. This is the power button. You then have a timer. You can set this to turn off at a designated time. Then you have two buttons that will control the colors. So you can see this will light up. If I hit this, um, it'll change the bottom color and you can rotate through. There's blue, green, red, kind of a yellow. It's like a lighter blue, pink. That one's more of a white and then back to red. And then we can also change the fire color in the back. So you can actually get some really cool combinations here. Um, this basically will activate um, the dimness so you can either make it really bright or uh, very low brightness. You also have um, this setting here which will speed up the actual fire effect. So you can actually make the fire effect go really fast or this is really slow. So that's actually kind of cool. And then this will ultimately turn on the heater. I have a electric panel that kind of designates the wattage and this will probably run at about 1000 to 1500 watts. So pretty standard for a space heater. Um, the fan will actually blow out the front here. Um, it does get very hot very quickly, but also bear in mind that we'll, you know, use quite a bit of electricity. So I would suggest using it sparingly. Overall, the whole look and aesthetic feel of this is great. The fireplace itself also comes with a remote with all the same functionality for like timer, heat, dimmer, speed, power, and then both your colors on your flame effects. So overall, I'm very, very happy with both the fireplace and the TV stand. I think this is something that's really quite nice. If you're looking for a set like this, I, I couldn't recommend it more. Anyway, thanks for taking the time to watch the video review, and I hope you found it helpful.